Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christian with PerfectStockAlert.com, a 100% free service for smart investors and traders. Today is Monday, September the 20th, 2010, and it's time to look at the markets. Okay, today we're going to start off looking at the NASDAQ. This index was up 40 points for the day. I had to go back to 11 months on this chart. I had to expand it so I could try to find a place on this chart where you had nine consecutive days to the upside like you have now. And we don't have it. Nine months as far back as I can go before I can't read the candlesticks. So uh, that's it. I, maybe one of you guys could find it tonight or something like the last time the, the uh, NASDAQ was up nine consecutive days in a row. But it's you know not anywhere in the last 11 months. The main point I'm trying to make here is that you're overextended. And we've been saying this since you passed seven. Uh, you, you just can't sustain that level. And a lot of guys, you know, the market goes up and they think, hey, now it's time to be a bull because prices went up. And you couldn't be more wrong, okay? I mean, absolutely ridiculous what's going on here. Markets have a particular pattern that they follow. And you'll notice one of the telltale signs, whenever a major trend breaks, like you had back here, okay? Major trend broke down right there. All of a sudden, you got an increase of sell volume, all right? So down she goes. But this is a long trend. They've been developing since March of 09. So you don't automatically say, oh, well, it's over. We're out of here. Now you fight it for a while. And when you do that fight, you have a particular type to it, a particular uh, style about it. And that is lots of volatility, okay? But you can always spot one under fake because the sell volume comes in. It's really strong on, on the upside there. You get lots of gaps and nasty signs along the way. Uh, telling you that this is not sustainable and then you look for those sell signals really big inverted hammers like that one right there or the one we saw on Friday the FTSE yeah we'll look at that in a minute anyway these are these main signals you see lots of extreme situations okay but it gets a lot of retail investors believing that oh this is awesome when in fact the market's peaking so you get that big volatility move to the upside then the big volatility move to the downside all right now here you are again, a big move to the upside, and right about now, people are getting really confident on their bullish side, you know? Only retail investors. Smart money is not. If you go look at the uh, put-call ratios that we looked at Friday, we did a video, put it on our website as well. Um, you can go there, check it out, free website at perfectstockalert.com, showing you that smart money is betting this market's going lower. Hmm, I wonder why. Well, let's look at it. You've got nine consecutive days to the upside never happened anywhere else in this 11 month chart all right you could still push higher I have no problem with that you can't sustain it how do you know that because those gaps you know one two three four five six seven oh yeah that's right and that giant telltale sign let me show it to you okay here it is the volume look at the sell side here we go here we go what are they doing they're taking up they're increasing the selling while price activity was preparing to tank. Okay, now buy volume, it's decreasing and price is increasing. What do you think is coming? Hmm, yeah, okay. One more item. We've talked about this before. You don't even need me once you know this. See right there? Big old signal pointing down the trend line there. Same time, price activity still pointing up. Price activity is lying to you, it's going to break down, all right? It's all right there on the chart. All you got to do is trust your chart. You want to argue with it? Go for it. Be the guys that want to buy up here. Let me show you what you're doing. Those guys who buy when price activity goes up, they're buying right now. Okay? When a slow stock is above the 80 line, that's this time period right here. Okay? Right here they were buying as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right here as well. Yep. Didn't work out so well, did it? No, it didn't. But they keep pointing back to this one. Right back here. Right back here. We could have made some money. Yep. Could have. I did. Because I knew it was unsustainable. You hope. Alright. Back here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Alright. So you keep doing it. You do it all you want. I'm going to play it safe and trust the chart. Okay? Awesome. Now, I know there's somebody out there that's going to say, But Mr. Williams, you don't understand. The Fed, they're going to devalue the dollar and drive stocks to the moon. We're all going to be happy. I got a question for you. I've already shown you last week, go back and watch the video, I showed you where we are following the 1929 crash to the T perfectly, all right? The 29 crash, the 30 bounce, the rollover, the whole thing, the fundamentals are the same, the technicals are the same. Now, my question is, you've had the Fed intervening this entire crisis, right? They've, they've gone out and just dumped billions and billions of dollars out there, all right? And we've not changed anything. 
from the technical perspective of the 29 crash and the 08 crash or the uh, 30 crash and the current 210 crash. So what makes you think now when the Fed be does something it's going to change anything? I, I don't get the logic there. Uh, they've been doing things and it's not changed the darn thing. So why now is it going to change the world? Uh, I don't get it. Uh, that's just me. I'm going to short this. And I'm going to stay short. And uh, for those of you guys that you know can't handle the, the kind of pain, well, then you need to be out of this. You don't want to be buying this market uh, at all. This is not a sustainable rally. Again, we talked about this earlier. We'll talk about it again. Whenever you're seeing that extreme volatility, this is a normal move for the market. Look at the size, okay? Normal move for the market. Look at the size. Abnormal move for the market, all right? Normal move for the market. Look at the size, all right? Normal, okay? Abnormal. All right. Yes, you can still become more abnormal, but you can't sustain it. All right. That's the key. Quick look here at the Dow Jones Industrial Average. You were up 145 points for the day. That's a big hoopla if you just look at price activity. Well, we don't. So when you look at the volume, you can see, wait a minute, if it's all that great of a buy opportunity, why isn't smart money getting involved here? They're absolutely not buying this market. Why? because it's not a quality buy opportunity okay no fundamentals have changed there's no reason fundamentally to rally back up to the point where you failed at before all right you were here before you got shot down because your fundamentals couldn't sustain it because you had all kinds of problems over there in Europe and all that stuff still exists and now here we are again and we're pressing higher pressing higher and the only people getting involved are people that don't know how to trade at all so uh, jump on board if that's your type of thing Personally, I recommend you go look at the put call ratios that tells you everything you need to know right there All right, and be on the side of smart money. That's just a good a good call You don't want to be on the other side because those guys lose a lot So if you've not been to our free website at perfectstockalert.com, it's right there It's a hundred percent free all we ask in return. Please refer a friend also we have a live uh, trading course that we do at our website and uh, you can go check it out there. We are accepting members for next month. Anybody who signs up for that month gets the rest of this month absolutely free. A quick look at our disclaimer. Wait a second before we go do that. This weekend, I crossed 2,900 subscribers on our YouTube channel. Thank you. I'd like to thank every single one of you guys that have been out there supporting our free service. Uh, you like what we do, you share it with your friends, you uh, refer your friends, share our videos online, everything else, and that makes it possible that we can stay free. I just want to say thank you guys for that. I'm going to keep working my tail off for you. Don't buy into this market hype. It's BS. A quick look at the disclaimer now. There's the disclaimer. Read it and weep. Also, for those of you guys that are looking for that video that we did this weekend, it's on our free website at perfectstockalert.com. Go into the chart school section, look up uh, put call volume analysis. It's very uh, enlightening. You definitely want to know where smart money is sitting and what dumb money is doing right now, which you can tell by looking at the chart. But in any event, go check it out. All right? Awesome.